Yeah, so for real. Uh -huh. I still want to explain more of the theory of the fake it till you make it. Why I'm not a fan of the fake it till you make it theme or phrase. It's because I never got there by faking it. And God has allowed me and blessed me to do a tremendous amount of things. I've had to work my you-know-what off to get there. Uh, and I've had coaches, I've had teachers, and I always find coaches and teachers, and still to this day, I resort to teaching and coaching people who know more than I do, you know, and uh, who can also inspire me to be the best I can be. Because it's about being the best you can be, and if it's available to do it, do it. If it's available to learn it, learn it. You don't need to fake it because no one really likes a fake. Let's be honest about it. I'm being real here. No one likes a fake. We, we know we can see somebody who's faking it from a mile away or a fake person or a fake thing. And so why not be the real deal as opposed to allowing someone to instill in your mind that the only way you can really get there, <laughs> they just fake it, just fake it, just fake it, you know, which is a theory that someone else came up with. Someone else came up with the fake it. So you make it and everybody started to accept it. It's what you accept in life to be true and real is what you will become. You become what you believe in, what you accept to be true. So somewhere along the line, people started accepting it and it's just the normal thing you hear people say. I was watching American Idol the other day uh, and I heard uh, someone say, oh, just fake it, just fake it, just fake it. What do you mean fake it? If you're the coach and you're coaching someone, teach them how to do it and teach them how to do it right. Teach them how to perfect your craft. It's about perfecting your craft, you know, and that's a part of bettering who you are and you become a better person by doing that, by getting with the teachers, getting with the coaches, putting the, the blood, the sweat, the tears, all that comes together, no matter what profession you're in, if you want to be on top. And everybody has the ability and everybody has something that they're unique at and something that they're good at that they could be at the top too with it, you know, but you have to figure out what that is and then work towards it. So that's why I'm not a fan. I don't teach it to my students or my clients, make it till you make it. I want them to know. And you know the people who train under me, they know that they better be out there doing it and they better know it because that's how I teach and I and I and it's about rising up to a higher standard. Woo!